हेलो एवरी वन एलू नमस्कार नाव ई विल डिस्कसिंग दि मोस्ट इंपारटेंट क्वेश्चन पेपर दैट इस मार्च एप्रिल टू थौस ट्वेंटी फोर एक्सामेशन वन सैंस पेपर सो ई विल डिस्कसिंग आल दि फिसिक्स पार्ट सो दिस इज पार्ट वन ई विल डिस्कसिंग आल दि आंसर्स आफ फिसिक्स इन दिस पार्ट ओके सो लेट अस बिगिन अवर डिस्कशन ओके सो ई जस्ट स्टार्ट विथ क्वेश्चन नंबर वन हियर सी द क्वेश्चन नंबर वन इज एलिमेंट यूज इन द सोलार सेल इज वॉट सिलिकॉन एज आई एक्सप्लेन ऑलरे इन मई प्रीवियस वीडियो येस द सिलिकॉन इज अ मेटल विच इज यूज इन सोलार सेल ओके ना कमिंग टू नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ओके सी इन एन इलेक्ट्रिक सर्क्यूट टू गेट एन इक्वालेंट रेजिस्टेंस आर एस सो आर एस मीन्स वॉट कनेक्टेड इन सीरीज सो वेन एन इक्वालेंट रेजिस्टेंस आर एस फोर रजिस्टर्स दैट मीन्स वन टू थ्री फोर टू 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 सो द टोटल रजिस्टेंस इज हाउ मच टू प्लस टू प्लस टू प्लस टू इट इज एट ओम ओके वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव सिक्स सेवन एट सो दिस इज रजिस्टेंस इन सीरीज नाव यू नीड टू कनेक्ट दम इन पैरल दैट मीन्स दिस वॉट दे सेट लेटर ऑन टू गेट एन इक्वालेंट रजिस्टेंस ऑफ आर पी द सेम रजिस्टर्स आर कनेक्टेड इन पैरल दैट मीन्स दे आर कनेक्टेड ऑल दिस फोर रजिस्टर्स वॉट इन पैरल इन सेकेंड केस दे आर कनेक्टेड इन पैरल टू 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 सो इक्वालेंट रजिस्टेंस इज वॉट वन बाय टू प्लस वन बाय टू प्लस वन बाय टू प्लस वन बाय टू वन टू थ्री फोर इट इज फोर बाय टू टू वन जा टू टू जा बट रेसी प्रोकल इज युअर आंसर सो आर पी इज वॉट वन अपॉन टू सो आई होप यू गॉट दिस हाउ डिड वी गेट Yes, RP is one by two. The reciprocal is your answer. Now, dear, ask what RS by RP. So RS we got it as how much eight. RP is how much half. This two will go here. We'll get sixteen is two. Sixteen by one. That is sixteen is two. One is your answer. So the, the, the what is the right answer now? See the right answer is what? It is option A. Sixteen is two. One is the right answer. So series will become sixteen and parallel will become one. So uh, that will be the ratio. I hope you got this. This was most of the challenging question, somewhat confusing. Okay, write a statement regarding the color of the scattered sunlight and size of particles, size of scattering atmospheric particles is. See, small particles scattered uh, red light. So this is wrong because smaller uh, particles sc scatter smaller wavelength of light. Since uh, uh, red is having high wavelength, it will not scatter. So big particles scattered blue light. Wrong because small blue is having small wavelength, so smaller wavelength scattered small uh, uh, particles. Okay, and small particles sc scattered small wavelength as already said is also wrong. so this is correct because two larger particles two larger particles scatter all colors equally here not all colors is white light equally and you know that white light consists of what all colors so the answer is two large particles scattered all colors equally that means white light equally so the according to the uh, methodology this answer should be the right one okay then coming to the next question that is question number 4 Okay, write the symbol of following components used in an electric circuit. So combination of cells. So red cell com combined mad beku. So one larger, one bigger, positive, negative, pos uh, positive, negative. Like this, you should able to draw. Then wires crossing without joints. So one wire will go here. Then it will not connect. So this is the answer. Then coming to question number five. Okay, see, can an electric heater two kilowatt be connected to a domestic circuit rated 15 ampere and has a potential difference of 220 volt? Support your answer. Can an electric heater two kilowatt? So they are given power is what two kilowatt. So I will write it as 2000 watt. Similarly, uh, they are given current I is equal to 15 ampere and they are given voltage which is equal to 200 volt. Now we need to find current. Okay, so we know the formula for power P is equal to V into I. So power is 2000, voltage is 220. We need to find current. Okay, so 2000 divided by 220 will give you I. So if you divide it, zero zero get cancel. 22 ones are 22, 9.09 is that. So you will get answer as 9.09. See the uh, after solving you get I is how much? 9.09 ampere. Okay, that is the answer you will get. See here, they said, can an electric heater two kilowatt be connected to a domestic circuit rated 15 ampere? Definitely, it is connected. Why? Because the power of two kilowatt is sufficient. Okay, because the current used is 9.09, which is less than the uh, rated current. So the rated current is 15. That is more than the required current. So definitely, we can connect. The answer is yes. We should support by using this formula and solving this. Okay. I hope you got. Wait, wait, wait! If you are getting it, kindly like, share, and subscribe. Okay, so that others will also get uh, useful to it. Okay, then they will get to know how much have they done correct or no. I hope everyone have done excellent because paper was very easy. Okay, now coming to question number six. What is spectrum of light? So spectrum is band of seven colors. Okay, band of seven colors we call it as spectrum of light, or band of component colors we call it as spectrum of white light. Name any two phenomena that occurs in the atmosphere due to refraction of light. So you know the, the rainbow, then uh, twinkling of uh, uh, stars. Okay, twink. Uh, that is the answer is twinkling of stars. 
okay then comes blue color of the sky then sunrise and sunset delay sunrise and uh, early sunset that all that the concepts will come in atmospheric refraction only so then comes next uh, our question in this that is what is cataract of eye see you know that in old age usually in old age due to the formation of uh, mem uh, one membrane over the lens so lens ke upar kya hota one uh, in about that one membrane will be formed due to which uh, your transparent layer will become what opaque that means it loses the person loses uh, its transparency and eye becomes opaque opaque means what it will become it completely becomes very dull so that we cannot see usually it will happen in old age due to weakening of ciliary muscles we can call it as uh, cataract then uh, what are the near points so the near point of normal vision is 25 cm and the far point is what infinity so the far point is infinity the answer is what near point 25 cm far point is infinity okay then the production of nuclear energy is advantageous and also disadvantageous clarify this statement with suitable explanation they said see you know nuclear energy is advantageous because it does not pollute so the pollution cost is very less and it is more efficient okay when it comp comes to the production of other forms it is more efficient form but when it comes to disadvantages it is very expensive first one is building up of nuclear power plant is very expensive and it produces a radioactive waste and disposal of this is very difficult disposal of radioactive material after the use is very difficult okay then coming to the question number 8 okay a person who has defect of eye as uh, shown in the below figure purchases a spectacle having a lens minus 2.0 uh, d uh, diopter power is this lens suitable to rectify the eye defect of that person as soon as you see this defect is called hypermetropia okay hypermetropia is a condition where a person can see far objects clearly but cannot see near Uh, objects distinctly that means uh, the image is formed what behind the retina that is hypermetropia and you know for hypermetropia the corrective lens is convex lens that is positive lens so the answer for this is what no okay see a person with this defect cannot use minus 2d because the uh, you should use convex lens that is positive lens of plus uh, any power of uh, any suitable power okay so the answer is no then you should draw the ray diagram uh, already you know ray diagrams are very important so the ray diagram of convex lens so suppose this is a convex lens uh, they have asked convex lens uh, when the image is kept at 2f1 so this is f1 i'll write 2f1 here this is o then this is f2 2f2 e will be here when the image is kept here it will hit the lens then it will pass through f2 directly it will pass through o where the image is formed you can directly see the image is formed at 2f2 okay and how the size of the image it is same size as that of object and it is real and inverted okay like this you should able to write this then very important uh, problems okay in every exam uh, this questions have come i'll just uh, deal with this questions 200 joules so 200 joules of heat is produced means what they have given heat is 200 joules and time is 1 second each second means 1 second and uh, the resistance is what 8 ohm okay now when uh, what is the potential difference see when they use potential difference directly you should use the formula v square by r into t see there is one more formula i square r t that is also correct in this first you should find i then you should find what uh, using ohms formula v is equal to i into r then you should multiply what uh, i and r then you will get but with this formula you will get directly so v square is how much so so you need to find here i'll just directly write here h is 200 v we need to find r is 8 and this is 1 it will go here 1600 is v square once v square root 1600 is v square so it is 40 volt sorry this is v okay so the v volt is how much it is 40 volt is the answer okay i hope you got this okay now i'll come to the next question in this okay next question kade hogona see the next question is what uh an electric refrigerator rated 300 watt so they have given power is how much 300 watt used for 6 hours in a day what is cost of energy to operate it for 30 days at rupees 7 per kilo watt hour so you know that uh, energy formula is what heat energy is equal to power into time so 300 by time divided by 1000 you should do why you should divide by 1000 because it is watt hour we should convert it into kilowatt okay so remember you should divide it by 1000 only so p is 300 into 6 divided by 1000 so if you just uh, 6 3 the 18 so 18 by 10 is 1.8 kilowatt hour that is heat now cost is how much heat into that is 1.8 into 30 days for rupees 7 so when you multiply this you will get uh, how much you will get 378 rupees okay so it you will get 378 rupees if you got 378 you will get the three mark okay so that like that you should able to do now i'll come to question number 
see in the domestic circuit what are the reasons for overloading see you know when does overloading happens when the current increases abruptly that means very much very much uh, current increases then uh, more than the capacity then second connecting too many circuits balanced circuit one the so many appliances sorry balanced appliances one the circuit connect maadi overloading aagtiti then if you are uh, touching what live wire and neutral wire live and neutral wire red color mat black color wire yaru touch aagibitre enaktavu overloading aagtiti then explain the working of earth wire you know earthing avaga martaru see when metallic which is uh, to, in order to protect the metallic uh, appliances and the metal body iddu for example refrigerator aitu washing machine aitu ac you ella ko earthing compulsory uh, computer madla pc computer sam bartiddu okay see ige metallic body or appliances is connected to earth by using a earth wire ee earth wire en martiddu antandra this will uh, any leak leakage okay to of an electrical appliances and the leakage i to current leakage i to then is transferred to the ground and prevent electric shocks in the electric appliances electric shock anything prevent madaka namaga ankul maadi kodutti now a insulated a, a coil of insulated uh, copper wire you can see this is a coil and it is uh, insulated copper wire and connected to galvanometer okay and when you bring uh, this uh, magnet near it what happens if a bar magnet to get they have asked so this is a pure uh, example of our faraday's experiment okay very important faraday's experiment uh, pushed what happens they have said when pushed in the coil see when the, it is pushed inside the coil there is a deflection in the coil first en aagtiti coil deflect aagtiti so ya yeah, side north side aakyaro south side aakyaro gottilla but if you insert this there is a deflection in the coil as soon as you withdraw from the inside the coil again there is a deflection but deflection takes place in opposite direction so you should know that deflection illeno aagtiti at in one direction here deflection opposite direction illen aagitadu opposite illa aagtiti he held a stationary inside the coil ಒಳಗೆ ಹೋಗಿ ಬರೀ ಇಟ್ಬಿಟ್ರೆ ನೋ ಕರೆಂಟ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನೋ ಡಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ನೋ ಕರೆಂಟ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ನೋ ಡಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಸೊ ನೋ ಡಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಅಂತ ಇಂಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ಕರೆಂಟ್ ಪ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ಆಗಂಗಿಲ್ಲ ಓಕೆ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಯು ಶುಡ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ನಾವು ಕಮಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಕ್ವಶನ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ದಿ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಥಮ್ ರೂಲ್ ಯು ನೋ ದಟ್ ಎಸ್ಟೇಡ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಐವ್ ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೈನ್ ಇನ್ ಒನ್ ಆಫ್ ದ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ವೆನ್ ಯು ಹೋಲ್ಡ್ ದ ರೈಟ್ ದ ಕಂಡಕ್ಟರ್ ಇನ್ ಯುವರ್ ರೈಟ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ದ ಥಮ್ ಇಂಡಿಕೇಟ್ ದಿ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಕರೆಂಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಫಿಂಗರ್ಸ್ ರ್ಯಾಪ್ಡ್ ಫಿಂಗರ್ಸ್ ಇಂಡಿಕೇಟ್ ದಿ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟಿಕ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ರೈಟ್ ಎನಿ ಟೂ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ಟೀಸ್ ಆಫ್ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟಿಕ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಸಿ ಯು ನೋ ದಟ್ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟಿಕ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ನಾರ್ತ್ ಪೋಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎಂಡ್ ಎಂಡ್ ಆಟ್ ಸೌತ್ ಪೋಲ್ ಔಟ್ಸೈಡ್ ದ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಇನ್ಸೈಡ್ ದ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಸೌತ್ ಪೋಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಎಂಡ್ ಆಟ್ ನಾರ್ತ್ ಪೋಲ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ಟೂ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟಿಕ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ದೇ ನೆವರ್ ಎವರ್ ಇಂಟ್ರೆಸ್ಟ್ ಈಚ್ ಅದರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದೇ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ಲೂಪ್ ಮೋರ್ ಕ್ಲೋಸರ್ ದ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟಿಕ್ ಫೀಲ್ಡ್ ಲೈನ್ಸ್ ಮೋರ್ ದ ಸ್ಟ್ರೆಂತ್ ಸೊ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಸೊಲೋನೈಟ್ ಯು ನೋ ಸೊ ಸೊಲೋನೈಟ್ ಅಂದರೆ ಏನು ಸಿ ಅ ಸಿಲಿಂಡ್ರಿಕಲ್ ಕಾಯಿಲ್ ವಿಚ್ ಇಸ್ ರ್ಯಾಪ್ಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಬೈ ದ ಇನ್ಸುಲೇಟೆಡ್ ಕಾಪರ್ ವಯರ್ ದಟ್ ವಿ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಆಸ್ ವಾಚ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಫಾರ್ಮ್ ಆಫ್ ಸಿಲಿಂಡರ್ ವಿ ಕಾಲ್ ಇಟ್ ಎಸ್ ಸೊಲೋನೈಟ್ ಹೌ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ದಿಸ್ ಬಿ ಕನ್ವರ್ಟೆಡ್ ಇಂಟು ಎಲೆಕ್ಟ್ರೋ ಮ್ಯಾಗ್ನೆಟ್ ಬೈ ಇನ್ಸರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಇದೊಳಗೆ ಏನಾಗಬೇಕು ಬೈ ಇನ್ಸರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ ಅಯನ್ ಕೋರ್ ಇನ್ಸೈಡ್ ದ ಕಾಯಿಲ್ ಸೊ ಸಾಫ್ಟ್ ಅಯನ್ ಕೋರ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿ ಒಂದು ಮೆಟೀರಿಯಲ್ ಬರ್ತೈತಿ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಒನ್ ಐ ಶುಡ್ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ಇನ್ಸೈಡ್ ದಟ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವಶನ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಫಿಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಓಕೆ ಸ್ಟೇಟ್ ಟೂ ಲಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಟ್ ಸೊ ಯು ನೋ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಸೊ ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಆ್ಯಂಗಲ್ ಆಫ್ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಷನ್ ದೆನ್ ದ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ ರೇ ರಿಫ್ಲೆಕ್ಟೆಡ್ ರೇ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ದ ನಾರ್ಮಲ್ ಆಟ್ ದ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಇನ್ಸಿಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಲೈ ಇನ್ ಸೇಮ್ ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ರೈಟ್ ಹನಿ ಟೂ ಡಿಫ್ರೆನ್ಸ್ ಬಿಟ್ವೀನ್ ಕಾಂಕ್ಯೂ ಮಿರರ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಕಾನ್ವೆಕ್ಸ್ ಮಿರರ್ ಸಿ ಕಾಂಕ್ಯೂ ಮಿರರ್ ಯು ನೋ it is what it is a converging mirror whereas convex mirror is a diverging mirror the image formed by the convex mirror is what it is always uh, the smaller that is diminished image the image formed by the concave is large enlarged or diminished the image formed by the concave can be real or uh, virtual the image formed by the convex is always virtual image the example for concave is it is used in solar furnace in dentist can use the convex mirror is used as a rear view mirror in the vehicle i hope you got all these questions thank you for watching wait 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 if you have come up to here kindly like share and subscribe okay thank you